Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Alas This. Pokemon Scarlet and Violet's newest expansion, Pardeo Evolved, has just released. And in today's video, I'm going to be opening a Pokemon Center exclusive, Pardeo Evolved Elite Trainer Box. So without Puffy. further speedy ado, let's get it. Alright guys, so here we have it. The Pardeo Evolved Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box. Here's the front. Top. Here's the sides. Bottom. And here's the contents. I'm going to be showing you all the contents inside anyway, so I'll leave it on there for a second if you want to read it. But let me crack into this box. Alright, so here's the inside of the sleeves. I think these will probably be the um, pack artworks. So the top one is Chien Pao. Ting Lu, I believe. I think it's that one. And then Skeledurge. Miascarada. And Quackabal. There you go. Here's the player's guide, which we'll get into in a minute. And the inside of the Elite Trainer box. The colors on these elite trainer, on this elite trainer box is actually quite nice. The, it's more vibrant. It's that side. There's the sides. And there's the sides. So here are your sleeves. I believe these are going to be the same. I think they changed up now where before you used to get different sleeves in the Pokemon Center variants compared to the regular ones. But I think they're the same as the regular ones now. I'm going to be doing a comparison anyway in probably the next video maybe. Here is it outside. And it's probably frosted. Yeah, it's frosted. So that's the sleeves. Here is your code card for the late trainer box. Here are the two promo cards. One without the stamp. The one on the right is with the stamp. And the one on the left is without the stamp. Here's a little comparison between the Japanese one, which I've got sealed, which I'm keeping sealed, and the English one. So the Japanese one has the Scarlet and Violet um, titles, I guess you want to call them, stamps, on the bottom left and bottom right. There you go. Here are your deck dividers. So, so kind of like the pattern on that side and then just plain black background on that side. And then your condition markers, your burn and poison condition markers, and the dice. So I believe these have been released before. I'm not sure in which products, I don't remember. But the only thing that's different is the actual dice itself. The color of it. It's kind of like radiated. With the blue, the orange, and the green, I think. But yeah, that's the content. And then you get 9 packs, one, 11 packs, sorry, 9 packs in the regular and then 11 packs in the Pokemon Center exclusive. 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 10, 11. Perfect. Alright, so I'm going to be opening two of these today in this video, guys. So I'm going to open the rest of the... Well, I'm going to open the other Elite Trainer box and then I'll be right back. Here's the code card for the other Elite Trainer box. And before we get started, guys, alright, let's check out the player's guide. So let's just skip straight to the set list. Here we go. Alright, so I know a couple of the, the cards, the um, special illustration rares and full arts, a bit of them. You can't avoid them mostly on YouTube because you see thumbnails and stuff like that, so you just see them anyway. But here's the front page. There's the first EX and the second EX, the male Skirada and the Fortress. And then the Wuchian. Here's the Fire and Water, so Skeledurge and Chiyu. And there's Quackaval. But, because this is three sets in one now, whereas Scarlet and Violet base was just Scarlet and Violet in the Japanese set, I think. So there's going to be more cards in this one now. It's going to be a bit harder to pull most of the cards, probably. So this is like more of a free setter in terms of Japanese. Play Burst, I think, Snow Hazard, and I forgot the other one. So here's the illustration rares. Oh, these illustration rares this time around are so nice. That's Brutito. I've got the actual evolution line artwork that they did for it. Really nice. That's probably one of my illustration rare chases. That Pyro reminds me of him um, Lion King. Here we go. For Coco and Crocolo, another evolution line artwork. That Magic Arc, I think everyone saw off the card. You can, you can see, there we go. That marrow is nice. Yeah, these illustration rares are so nice this time around, man. So nice. And then Tyranitar, that's probably another chase for me. In terms of illustration rares. 
some more here and then here's the full art oh that chain pal definitely a chase for me that chain pal is a chase for me and cool and then we got these ones Grusha is another chase for me and then I think you can see a pattern here Grusha and chain pal those are my chases so the, both the full art and then the special illustration rares forms of these cards there's a crucial one oh my chase cards and then there's the goals and the secret rares and then the promos there you go that's the players guide also before we get started here's the five pack artworks there's the meals Corrado, the chien pao the ting lu skillet urge and quackabao before i get cracking into these packs guys if you're new to the channel if you haven't already i'd appreciate if you could leave a like subscribe Turn notifications on for more. When I reach 500 subscribers, I'll be doing a giveaway for a Paldea Evolved Elite Trainer Box. So without further ado, let's get into it. So first pack, first pack of Paldea Evolved. I'm kind of excited for this. Those couple of chases that I mentioned, really nice cards. I love to pull those. And then there is some illustration rares as well that I had, that were in there. All the illustration rares in this um set quite nice this time around all right so we're starting with a basic energy lightning super i love this this one's gonna be a bit of a longer video as well because i want to see some of the commons and uncommons azamaru rest between fletchling no first pack magic Taranito. nice by the time you guys see this video i might upload it off schedule and earlier than what my normal schedule would be by the time you see the video, it's probably going to be a bit late. So maybe you guys have opened up your own Paldea Evolved. If you have, let me know how your hits have been. Oh, that's a nice Pikachu. And if you're enjoying Paldea Evolved right now. I mean, from what I can tell, the set list is quite nice. I like it. Nothing in this one. I'm hearing pull rates are the same. But the only difference is because there's more secret rares and there's more illustration rares or whatever more there's more cards in the set list it's harder to pull the, the heavy hitters psychic energy pine crow think of thing monkey the bird giacomo and a flame Harry cross snova tarantula Ariam. so three packs in so far nothing even illustration rare not even the ex i mean historically pokemon center etbs have been good to me throughout all of my Pokemon Sun and ETB openings and Scarlet and Violet wasn't bad from what I can remember Scarlet and Violet basically wasn't bad is this gonna be my first bad one? maybe for the bird chocolate oh nice maybe not so we pulled a full art to you yet nice so there's an ultra rare I love the background color I love the background color I think all of you by now probably know if you're actually a regular to the channel is baby blue blue my favorite colors and this card the background makes it pop nice i mean the centering on that to you is quite quite poor i mean i don't i don't think there's been a single set that i've opened where i've gotten decent cards High five. High five. High five. Right. Like when I off camera, when I check some of the cards to see if I can grade some, like double and stuff, I've never, I don't think I've gotten one worth 10 for all of my opening. Like I always get like the most uncentered, well, most uncentered cards that are most likely going to be nine. Here and there, I've gotten a few that'll be worth tens, but generally, generally cards that i want to grade never gotten worth grading like i'm a perfectionist i look for perfection so i'm looking at the centering perfectly i'm looking at everything perfectly and they just don't seem to be grade worthy Nucky. Yahoo! nice i guess sort of a chase card because it's chien pao and then the color of course that baby blue kind of icy color nice that's a good pull for me just about halfway through the first ETB and we pulled um if I can get this open we pulled a full art and the yeah oh my days I'm gonna damage these cards in a minute come on come on here we go all right 
right, so this. I don't think that's gonna spoil it. No, it doesn't. High five. High five. High five. Pavel, Pavel, I've been looking forward to um, Obsidian Flames. Hello. Cerulege. That's a nice hollow. Cerulege. I can't wait till they make Cerulege and Armourage into special illustration rares or full arts. Yeah, I am so looking forward to a Cerulege Flames. Uh, seen a few cards, just by spoilers, of course. But since that's going to be the 151 set or the Generation 1 set, oh my days, that's going to be a banger. That one I can't wait for. So Toto, Trudel, Balint, Jigglypuff. I done spots, Jupiter. How can I come on? Show me an illustration rare at least. Nope. Nope. I mean, I follow on an EX from a ETB. Kind of expected. Come on. Generally, ETBs, even though I keep saying Pokemon Center ETBs are good to me. Generally, ETBs in general aren't even that great anyway. Fire, Pokip, Jupiter, Naiba, Bombi. Of his fire, jet energy, fighting, all light, all fighting, all up. Oh, I don't even know why I'm trying to pronounce that. That's you. Oh, that's illustration rare. Oh, I got confused there for a second. Powder and Taurus, nice. I wouldn't say it's a chase, but Powder and Taurus is a nice one for me as well. Actually, yeah, that's a chase because I'm a Taurus in terms of star signs. So, yeah, nice. And a wiggly tough. A little bit off topic, topic a little bit off topic guys but bloody hell it's summer starting to just come around in the uk and oh my days it's so hot past couple of days have been so hot and me filming this video now i am sweating it and i have to wear this bloody beanie on my head as well just to keep up with i guess appearances and my head is sweating my whole body so i am sweating it it is so hot magic heart Amigo, Weaver. Yeah, so the summer has just about started now in the UK, and I hate heat. I, mean, I hate UK heat. Like, I hate it. And it only makes it worse now when it comes to filming because obviously I can't film topless or I can't film thingy. I guess I can film in verse and then the, the beanie, I guess I can get rid of as well, but I want to keep up with appearances. So I'll rather keep on, but I hate the heat. With, uh, no last pack magic, none. All right, so three hits in the first one a full art, a EX, and an illustration rare. Not bad, I guess. Not too bad, to be honest. 11 packs, not bad. Before we get started into the second ETB, if you're currently enjoying the video and you stuck with me this far, I'd appreciate it if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more. When we reach 500 subscribers, I'll be doing a giveaway for a Paldea Evolved Elite Trainer box. So, without further scooby ado, let's get into the rest of the video. Alright guys, ETB number 2. Is this one going to do better than the first one? I kind of hope so. I mean, the best outcome you can get. I guess full arts are not too bad as well, but the best outcome you can get from a, um, ETB, regardless of it's Pokemon Center or not, an ETB in general, is a SIR. That will make up for... Nope. Gyarados, that's a nice Gyarados as well. That's a nice artwork. Wow, and we got the double banger. Reverse and hollow. Yeah, pulling an SIR. Special illustration, special illustration rare from an ETB would be the best outcome. And then, oh, this, that, this, I spoiled it completely, but. And, and that thingy. So, there's gonna be nothing in this one. Yep, flesh healing, hop it. There we go. Right, so, so far, nothing in this one. Oh, this pack opens so beautifully and easily. They need to be, they all need to be more like that. Hi -bye. Hi -bye. That's gotta be a better way for me to do that hat trick. Get the energy and the thing out of the way. Oh, belly bolt EX, nice. There's our first EX, I guess, from this ETB. got a few Paldea Evolved videos lined up for you guys, I've got a few. So if you're enjoying Paldea, uh, Paldea Evolved um, 
park opening experience stick around guys stick around I've got quite a few videos to make do to upload that you can see if you're enjoying the holiday evolved um experience mr rivers your offer jump up. let me know in the comments down below as well guys if you're if you're excited for obsidian flames if you're a gen 1 -er and obsidian flames is tickling your fancy right now because it is very much tickling mine i can't wait for that one but i'm i think i might just go um let's go with that except rough for five five wow nice we got the reverse into the illustration rare nice that's a good artwork as well for the graphite for illustration rare that's an actual nice artwork so so far an ir and a ex for etb are we gonna get a another full art or a sir at least sir come on replace that full art i'm gonna get a full art with sir julipa Giraffe Rig, Tropius, Mousehold, Tinker Turf, Formal, Feather, Feather, Wow, Therapeutic Energy, Wow, words didn't want to come out of my mouth, Spiritito, Garnacle, 5 packs left guys, 5 packs left, 5 packs left, so there was 11 per box, 22 in total, and we've only pulled 5 hits, Oosh, Water Energy, Magic Pop, Slowpoke, Leo, Rockra, Primate. That's quite a nice Primate. Crucial, Miss Magius, Murkrow, Limit. Yahoo! Are you kidding me? Are you absolutely kidding me? No, look at the centering on that man. That that center. This ETB is gonna be more or less exactly the same. But watch, I'm only gonna pull this, that Graphite Fire and Belly Ball. And that's only gonna be the hit the only hits could have put anything anything out of the multiple full arts and i pulled a double already and that cheap really really you're gonna give me a double my second etb already energy grateful pocket akuita encouraging operator control calamit calamitous calamitous wasteland calamitous wasteland Delivery drone, fine call, luxury. Three packs left. I think these are gonna all be duds because uh, it looks like somehow the case. Because I bought a case of these elite trainer boxes, the Pokemon Center ones. You get four in the case. One, one I'm keeping sealed. Two I'm opening today. One I'm gonna open versus a regular trainer box. And I'm guessing they have like the same kind of batch sort of regular, kind of batch pull rates. As you can see from here, we pulled a full art illustration rear and an EX. And then the second one, full art illustration rear and an EX. And if I don't pull anything else, then it's looking like all of my ETBs are going to be pulling the exact same thing. So in my third ETB, probably going to be pulling, yep, yep. In my third EP ETB, probably going to be pulling a full art EX and an illustration rear, which I guess. If I didn't pull a double or duplicate of that Chiyu from the second ETB, I would have been happy. Fair enough. But if that third one that I open gives me another Chiyu, that's not going to be. That's not going to be. Cool. Yes, now this one. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I kind of was a bit reaching there. But this energy looks so nice. Oh my days, they made this look way better than the Scarlet and Violet base set one, I think. This leaf energy, gold, looks so secret rare. Wow. Alright guys, so that was the Powder Evolved Pokemon Center exclusive elite trainer box. We managed to pull 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 hits from 22 packs. Two full arts, two EXs, two illustration rares, and a secret and a hyper rare. I think they're called hyper rares. Secret rare gold energy. Not bad to be honest in terms of ETV pull rate. Not bad. One of each. Only thing we're missing is a secret art rare. I mean, special illustration rare. But yeah, I'll take that from my two my first two boxes. 
yeah i'll take that all right so next video will probably be the pokemon center elite trainer box versus the retail one but yeah guys if you enjoyed the video if you stuck with me to the end i'd appreciate if you could leave a like subscribe turn notifications on for more when we reach 500 subscribers i'll be doing a giveaway for a power day of the elite trainer box peace